Alrighty then, Triumph Street Triple RS. Unfortunately, as before, the guy's coming with me, which sucks. Hmm. Sexy. はい。クイックシフトはウェイトした両方うん。あいよ。うん。<音声><音声><音声> Okay. Alrighty. Didn't get enough time to uh, mess with the settings because this old boy seems to be in a rush. Ooh. First thing's good, first uh, impressions. Riding position is very upright though, it's very super jukey. Not going to use my indicators because. Oh yeah, baby. S sexy sound. Uh, the, the controls are a little bit, I'd say, awkward for me. I got long fingers, but I couldn't quite. Um... Yeah, it's going to be hard to get used to a quick shifter again. Okay, I can indicate right. Yes, nothing coming. At least he's not a pussy, this old boy. Come on, man. I want to do some some speeds, yo. Don't want to be doing this bullshit. And we better not be waiting in the traffic. Uh, it does have a quick shifter on the way down. Go on, do it. You know you want to. Go on. Go on. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> On the gate! Not the asset! Riding mode! TC! Sport! Okay. Whoa, what's that? El Camino? Okay, so I've turned the traction control onto sport mode now, so hopefully that's going to make it a bit livelier. It's certainly not um, overwhelming, I'll say that. Obviously I haven't gone real high up in the revs yet, but it seems to be very easy to ride. Oh, cool man. Japanese Mexican. <laughs> Position's good though, I do like the position. The bars are nice and wide. Uh, my actual legs feel, feel really good too. It's not, not cramped whatsoever. I thought it could be. But it's not. Okay, that's third. Oh, the display's a little bit slow. I was in third before it said three. Okay, he said go left, I think. Okay, indicate left. Uh, the indicator thing's kind of small. It's wheelie then, it, 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 it come up a little bit. <laughs> oh, I like it. Me like it. Yeah, yeah, the power's not, um, it's not over, it's not too much. It's not scary whatsoever. How's this quick set for four, fifth, six, six, four. 
This is the only test ride I've been on where the guy hasn't been a puff. Well done, this guy. And she does like to wheelie off the power, that's nice. <laughs> I like this bike. Hopefully he's not looking in the mirrors the whole time and going, you fucking hooligan, stop it! <laughs> You've got to do a wheelie though, haven't you? Uh, it powers up really easily in first, and then I accidentally um, clicked second because of that quick shifter, because I'm not really used to sensitive bikes like this, but I reckon you could easily clutch this up in second and then get straight into third and just wheelie all day long. But. I don't know if I can do it now with the traction control on sport mode. Does that let you do wheelies, I wonder? They should just have an option that says wheelie okay. Like, you should be able to do wheelies, but traction control should still work and the ABS should still work. Just like hooligan mode or something. Well, that'd be a much better way to do it. Tell you what, the suspension's nice too. I'm going over these bumps here. I don't know if you can see the bumps in the road so well, but soaking them up really nice. Here's a bump. Yeah, it's like, it's very plush. Feels great. Mirrors, I forgot to adjust, so I can't see shit, but whatever. The clutch is nice too. I guess with the clutch, uh, you know, these modern quick shift equipped bikes, the clutch feel isn't so important on, you know, like riding like now. But just check going down the gears, you can you can feel it, the the biting point. So if you wanted to be going on the track and doing some, you know, half clutch, like banging it down the gears and then you know like letting the clutch out slowly to to um, not lock up the back, I think it could be it could be good for that. Obviously, it's hard to tell on, on a, a quick little test ride like this, but it feels it feels good. And it's nice having the cable car. Oh, the, the adjuster's spinning. Oh, that's not good. The adjuster is spinning. But uh, yeah, it's um, it's interesting for sure. But yeah, as I was just saying, having a cable clutch, like a lot of people these days think like, oh, unless you've got a hydraulic clutch, it's like a cheap bike or something. But I think, actually, having a cable is way better. Yeah, like that. I could feel it bite and it, it just felt nice. Nice and smooth. That uh, dash is definitely slow though. I was into neutral then way before the neutral light came on. Yeah, the riding position is good. Was it what they like, the forks? Fa they feel fairly stiff. But nice, but nice. Those lovely Brembo's on the front. I like the styling too. What are these, crash bars? I hope you guys can hear the engine noise because it sounds really sweet. Got to, got to remember to stop using the clutch. Oh, it's very, very smooth, that clutchless gear change. Left, okay sir. A bit of a corner is there. Oh, <laughs> wrong button. All right, have we got enough? enough room here to do it. Oh, it's really, it's really difficult for me to get used to this quick shifter. You just touch it a little bit and it, and it goes into gear. I was actually just trying to get, get into a wheelie position then. Should we just try a little sneaky wheelie and see what happens? take the piss on the test ride. If he wasn't in front of me I totally would but <laughs> anyway 
but I can say for sure it would wheelie like a mofo really easily. I'm glad he's taking me on the long course as well, that's good of him. Yeah boy. Yeah, I like. These are cool too. I got the same one on my Super Duke. Yeah, so it's got the fully adjustable shocks on it. Forks even. It's only got one shock on the back. I see this dude's probably like enjoying it because he, he's working. But he gets to ride bikes. So he's probably like he's well up for going on the long the long route. Oh it's starting to rain a little bit. Starting to rain a wee bit. Ah! After he was telling me like why don't I try the 1200 and I was like nah 1200 has got way too, way too much power for me I don't need that much power but actually this I don't know I don't want to say it but it feels slightly lacking I'm slightly underwhelmed yeah buddy now I guess that is uh, actually the traction control that's stopping it from doing doing big stonking wheelies. Because I was way on the throttle then and it came back down, so we'll probably have to turn the TC off to, to do stonking big wheelies. Oh yeah, it holds the line too. Obviously you guys can't, you know, 100 percent take my word, word for it on a little test ride like this, but just then it it doesn't wallow in the corner or like you don't feel like it's going to change like you can lit I reckon you can commit to a line and you can stay on it let's try try and keep as close to the yellow line as possible yeah definitely this handles really well oh it's just a shame I'm on <laughs> with this guy <laughs> even though he is a nice guy Oh, I'd love to just take this up to Yahagi Dam for a, an hour and have a play. Maybe I could actually rent one. Oh, but yeah, it's it's good, man. I wonder if we can... Let's, let's try and get into a track control mode off. Ah, oh, fucking lights. Ah, uh, the mode doesn't work in neutral like other bikes do. You actually have to be stopped. Ah, oh, bollocks. Alex wanted to whack that traction off see if it makes see if it helps yeah I don't know if you guys could could see that or tell from the video but as soon as it came up the ignition cut and it came back down again so we got to turn that off for maximum fun I've got to say as well just riding the thing you can sort of see the the build quality and everything it's it's nice oh wait i can change the modes like this can't i can i go into track mode track mode ah oh, you motherfucker you can't go into track mode Shit. turn right yes sir Acting like a fool, but fun. I have a glass in my head. Hey, baby. 
come on, be long enough for me to put it into track mode or turn the TC off. Please, 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 please. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, you've... The only time I want a red light, there never is one. That's so typical, isn't it? <laughs> Oh, I love the quick shifter though, it's real, real smooth. Real smooth. Getting me some of them smooth ropes. Oh, it's very, very confident. Inspiring. That's what all motorcycle journalists say, so I've got to say it. It's so confidence inspiring. Oh, this one's going to change as well. God damn it. I literally cannot believe this. All I want to do is turn traffic control off and all the lights are green. Oh, that's smooth. Let's go down. Do you have to blip it? I'm not sure if you have to blip yourself. Hey, okay, boss. Turn left, he said. Go left, young man. Go west, young man. Oh, even on slow, slow stuff like that, where you go around the corner and you bang it up into second, and it's very smooth. The bike doesn't feel unsettled at all. Ah, man, quick shifters are the future. Maybe nobody knew this except me, but quick shifters are awesome. But it'd do wicked stoppies too. Oh, I wonder if he'll let me take the 1200 out by myself. That would be sweet. Even this nice little detail, isn't it? Nice Triumph logo on the fuel cap. Paint's nice too. I like the emblems, the way they stick out a lot. Oh, time to go. Time to go, Sonny. Okay, dude, I know. I got it. I got it. I got it from my girl. Ah, neutral. Oh. Obviously, I wasn't positive enough with my foot then. It's my fault, not the bike's fault. This guy rides like um, the dude at work. Maybe it's a generational thing, because this guy's probably in his late 40s. He does that whole, like, I don't know, he proper tips it in on the first turn. <laughs> but I just, like, I just cruise in like, hey, cool. But he's like, mm, bangs it over. Uh, this place is freaking awesome, man. This shop is so amazing. Every make that you can think of under one roof, and it's massive. It's got cars in there as well as bikes. So there's a sign there, we've got Triumph, Ducati, MV Augusta, Aprilia. What are you saying? Okay, okay buddy. I gotcha. Oh. Uh, <laughs> what is up guys? Guess what? I've just finished my test ride and now the heavens have literally opened up like crazy crazy thunderstorm, super loud thunder, massive streaks of lightning, the roads are all flooded and I have got to ride my Suzuki home which has recently started misfiring in the rain. So I'm going to have an absolutely miserable ride home, but I've got to do it because it's nearly four o'clock and I've got to go and pick up my daughter from school. So lucky me. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed today's test ride video. If you did, please hit that like button. And if you haven't done already, please do subscribe to my channel. All right, guys, see you in the next video. Goodbye.